Hi, welcome again to my Arc Linux B Gnome. Maybe you've seen my video and saw that I'm very, very happy again on my Gnome system since we have all keyboard shortcuts. Super Shift Return is here and we have Super Q to kill everything and so on and so on. Control Alt V for Vivaldi, etc. etc. It's all there. Now, this video is about something I learned yesterday making this new themed and, and tweaked and um, with all the keyboard shortcuts present GNOME. There is an issue, I had an issue, so I want to share it in this specific video. It's all about dconf. So I'm not gonna uh, tell you technically what it all is. The internet is a big place. GNOME dconf and you go and check what it all is. Oh my god, it's still on the version where you google do not google but bing your way around in the world which is not the proper way to find things so gnome dconf you have projects here gnome dconf project manage users etc you just take a look just saying simply um it's a kind of database that's kept with uh, with the system and it's going to, it's, you can't open it. It's an, an compiled thing. So you get strange things in there and it keeps all the data, all the settings um, in there. Something like, I don't know, like in Windows, you have these registries and these hives and all that. So things like that. So, so a place where all the settings are kept. So keep on uh, reading about it. But the thing is, and that's the point, uh, I know all about this, but GNOME has something specific, something strange. When you go to Super Shift Return and Control H, I was all the time uh, making a new dconf for the user here. So this file in here, you see all these ones and zeros and ones, it actually, it is true. You can't open this guy, it's just gibberish. The only way to open this thing is open it with dconf editor. So. I've been working with this tool, dconf editor, and um, you can actually find stuff and, and look and search here, things and etc. Now the thing is, the strange thing is, if you uh, update the system, which we've just done, there was an update. So you do an update, you see somewhere in the line, Arch Linux config gnome git, right? It's going to scale. So you say, okay, no problem. I do a scal and this thing is overwritten but um, that's not true that's not true you need to check that if it's true right so I've had it several times that um, the user database is not overwritten some kind of protection I don't know it's really gnome specific so etc scale so what I what I'm doing to really be sure that I get my last settings in to actually click here and drag here to so you see the difference between the one and the other and what do you know great for the tutorial it's not the same I let it sink in the numbers are not the same so the scale command which is great for everything else just does not cut it when you're talking about deconf and GNU right so this specific file that you're having contains the old settings so you will never see the new stuff which is in etc scale dconf user so you need to do it manually so okay replace all and just to be really paranoid para, 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 paranoia yeah that's the word <laughs> you need to again check all right now i have exactly the same thing replace again right the strange thing for this, this matter is if you delete the home eric.config dconf user file, it just takes a while to just type in or do something, press some buttons, hop, there it is again. It's magically reappeared. But the fun thing is, it's gonna be the old one again. Hours I've spent figuring that out, okay? So now you know GNOME settings deconf user manually copy paste it over once it's copy pasted once it's there 
it will not be replaced again with the old one but if you delete it it will become the old one again strange right as long as you know knowledge is power as long as you know it's all fun but this is something you need to remember if you want to work on gnome and want to get our last settings in because that's basically it if you don't want to have our last settings in no problem right okay cheers